On this day in working class history, the 20th of July. On the 20th of July 1979, Native American political prisoner Leonard Peltier escaped from Lompoc Federal Correctional Institution in California with two other detainees, one of whom, Bobby Jean Garcia, was shot to death by a guard. Peltier, a leading member of the American Indian movement, had been sentenced to two consecutive life sentences for the deaths of two FBI agents. He'd been warned by fellow Native American prisoner Standing Deer that there was a contract on his life in the prison. Peltier's original trial was riddled with inconsistencies and distortions. For example, an FBI ballistics expert claimed that during the trial, a shell case found near the bodies matched Peltier's rifle. But his report stating that the cartridge didn't match was withheld from the jury. And three witnesses who placed Peltier near the scene of the crime later recanted, stating that the FBI had tied them to chairs and coerced their testimony. The legal misconduct was so severe that Peltier has received support from individuals and groups as diverse as Nelson Mandela, Archbishop Desmond Tutu, the European Parliament and the United Nations Commissioner for Human Rights. Peltier was recaptured three days after his escape. Learn more about Native American resistance in the latest episodes of the Working Class History Podcast. You can currently listen to them early at patreon.com slash workingclasshistory. Link in the show notes. For sources, maps, and all of our anniversaries each day, check out the On This Day section of our Stories app at stories.workingclasshistory.com. And if you value our work, support us at patreon.com slash workingclasshistory. Links in the show notes. The music by Ricardo Areo. See you tomorrow.